Preparation. Glueless laminate can be installed directly over most existing floor coverings, except for carpet. Wood flooring glued to concrete must also be removed before installation of laminate flooring can begin. Acclimation. Cartons of flooring must lay flat and unopened in the room in which they are to be installed for a minimum of 48 hours before the installation can begin. Relative humidity should be maintained during the acclimation and installation periods at conditions of 60 degrees Fahrenheit to 85 degrees Fahrenheit and 35% to 65% relative humidity. Cartons should be stacked no more than three high with four inches of airflow around each carton and should be stored away from any heating, cooling ducts, or direct sunlight. Subfloor moisture testing. Test the subfloor for excessive moisture before installing over concrete, concrete covered with ceramic tile, marble, stone, or vinyl tile or linoleum. To do so, cut three foot by three foot squares of polyethylene plastic, one plastic square for every 200 square feet of floor space. Spread the plastic around different areas of the concrete subfloor for a more accurate evaluation. Firmly tape down and seal all edges of the plastic directly to the concrete subfloor. Leave the plastic down for 24 to 48 hours. If moisture forms under the plastic or if the cement darkens, perform a calcium chloride moisture emissions test. The maximum allowable reading is five pounds per 1,000 square feet for a 24-hour time period. Call the Shaw Information Center hotline at 1-800-441-7429 for more assistance with moisture testing or other technical questions. Subfloor preparation. Fill any low spots in the subfloor greater than 1 8 inch in 6 feet with a Portland cement leveling compound. Check this by using a 6 foot straight edge. Remove any high spots by sanding or grinding. Remove any existing floor moldings, except for the wall baseboards, unless you plan to replace those with Shaw color-coordinated wall bases. Remember, thoroughly sweep the subfloor clean.